Limpwort are the opposite of strong. They're limp. Gold is strong. Hey, that's me, Zip. I've been playing RuneScape for years. Bossing, skilling, you name it. But after all this time, I have no pets. Last time on Zip No Pet. By running over agility shortcuts, I'll give you some cash to face the Abyssal Sire. How about 10k per obstacle? Oh, come on, it's so close. Oh god. Oh! Yes! That was a lot closer than I would have liked it to be. <laughs> First one of the task, an unsired. About a 400 streak dry. Oh no! It was the jar! Okay, bludgeon piece. Another bludgeon piece. And so what I expected to be maybe a two unsired task turned into a full bludgeon and a jar of miasma. Zip! Zip! Come over here! Huh? Why don't you just walk over here? I, uh, just come on, now! Okay, okay, what is it this time? You've been doing daily farm runs for Tangleroot, right? Well, after I got 99 farming, no. What? You want a pet, don't you? Yep. And you like Tangleroot? Yep. Best way to get Tangleroot is to farm every day. That makes sense to me. So, do your farm runs. I'm already 99 farming. Okay, you know what? Challenge time. Here, go do these riddles. If you complete the riddles, you know what? Giant mole, go crazy. But when you fail, it's time to start hunting. Oh, like more pet hunting? Herbivore, 1500 KC. This can't be too bad, right? Let's get started. Go to the start and please have faith. This clue is the easiest. You'll be okay. Go to the start and please have faith. It sounds like it's a prayer potion, which is made using Renar weed. If that's what it is, what would the start be? Is there any other like way to construe start? Not really. Okay, you know what? Maybe we skip this one. Next one. Jackie the fruit wants to make some rum. Pick the right tree so your quest is more fun. So Jackie the Fruit lives on an island, Karamja. What goes well with rum, I guess? I feel like bananas and rum, that feels like a tropical drink. Okay, final answer, banana tree at Brimhaven. Your least used patch in your most used place. Help me change the color of Rocky's face. I believe poison ivy berries and red berries both change Rocky's face color. Your most used place. Oh, I guess that's probably the farming guild, right? I love the farming guild. All right, red berry bush at the farming guild. Final answer. Tree that you cannot fletch into its bow. You could try to use your second toys, but I don't know how well that would go. And it doesn't say where to plant it, which means there's only one way to do it. Oh, maybe it's a crystal tree. You can't fletch a crystal tree into a crystal bow, but a crystal bow does exist. I believe that. Let's try that one. The Easter flower is what Marisi seeks. Maybe from your house you could take a peek. A flower location that's near a house portal? Uh, by Hosidius? I guess that makes sense to me. It could be white lilies. The marigold was kind of colorful, so... That's why I feel like it's probably that one. Marigolds in Hasidious. Final answer. Wait, what? Right spot, wrong flower. The Easter flower is the white lily. Ugh, fine. Let's do the next one. The fruit can be crushed. The product quite mellow. Cheers me now or it's straight to the gallo. It's like orange, like orange crushes. I don't know. I'm feeling lecha don't really know why, just because I guessed it's like double L's. You know, we're talking about mellow, gallows. This one I'm not super sure. All right, we're going with an orange tree in Lecce. No Zip, I was looking for Gallo the Gardener at the Hosidius Vinery. I've never seen this place in my life. Next, I guess. The deadly nightshade that grows somewhere grim, hopefully harvesting it isn't a sin. I think there's only thing, one thing called nightshade, right? Is it Belladonna? I'm pretty sure you can only plant this in Draenor Village. Let's go with Belladonna at Draenor Manor. 
I want to have a party in a cool room. Can you bring something to throw that makes a fun boom? What grows in a room? All the herb patches are outside. I mean, the farming guild is, is inside. What if we go get a palm tree? I don't know. I feel like you could throw a coconut inside the farming guild, I guess. This doesn't make a lot of sense to me, but we're going to do it. it I would argue maybe it doesn't even make any sense. Obviously, it doesn't make sense. I was looking for the Falador party room. You should have planted tomatoes in Falador. Oh, I see. Do you have the spirit? Then cheer loud and strong. Return to your preferred bank, plant a flower. Hope you aren't wrong. Is this one really like, I have to guess which flower it is and just hope I'm right? <laughs> this limpwort are the opposite of strong, they're limp. Okay, so that would, that narrows it down for us. So it's marigolds or it's white lilies, maybe? Gold is strong. We're going marigolds. The, the reasoning behind that one is not, not great. So close yet so far. Limpwort makes strength potions, Zip. Okay, but it's in the name. At the rim, you don't have to mine. I just want help to change red back this time. You can plant berries at Remington. So we want to change it back to regular Rocky. Is it white berries would turn it back to raccoon looking? Let's try white berries at Remington. I'm craving a pet. Could you give me a hand? For grinding past 99, this is where you should stand. What the hell does that mean? So it's one of the skilling pets. Yeah, okay, let's go Redwoods. Let's go Redwoods. I think that makes the most sense to me. Redwood tree at the farming guild for the beaver pet. The last thing we have to do is just go back to the first one, which was go to the start and please have faith. This clue is the easiest, you'll be okay. We were able to do every other one in order, but for some reason, I'm too stupid to understand this one. It could be Snape grass and that could be about faith. But then what is the start? Nothing else really makes that much sense to me, to be honest. I don't know what the right answer is. What is the start? Well, we're going to plant some Snape grass in Falador, I guess. Really? The start in Falador? It was an oak tree in Lumbridge. Okay, yeah, I do see that now. Well, Zip, you got five out of ten. That's enough for giant mole, right? Nope. Hope you like Fossil Island. First thing you need to know about Herbie Boar is it's incredibly simple. This is probably one of the freest pets to get. If you're using Rune Light, the Herbie Boar plugin basically does the whole activity for you. You just click the blue boxes and follow the tracks around the map. It's pretty easy. Generally, all you need to do this is some graceful gear, some magic secateurs if you have them, and some stamina potions. Everything else is kind of just extra on top of that. The only other thing left is I have 310 KC before we get started. Let's go. There's a lot of these hunts and not that much interesting happens in between, but here we go. This is number 350. 400. 84 hunter. Cool. Sometimes the herbie board gets away from me. 450. Number 500. 550. Woo! 85. Okay, this is number 600 here. We'll continue our talking about talk in a second. Number 600. Very nice. Okay, 650. Nice. 700. 86 hunter. 750. There's 800. 850. 87 hunter, 900, 950, 999, and 1000. Let's go. We're not done yet. 1050, 88 hunter. Let's go. 1100. How could I forget to say 1150? We lost them again. 1200. We got Sunday and Monday. <laughs> okay, and then when you put it that way, actually, yeah, it's not that crazy. Oh, 1250. I forgot. Okay, here it is. 89 hunter. 1300, 1350, 1400, 1450, hey, 90 hunter, 25th total, 1500. Well, after this, we took all the fossils we got and cleaned them so we could use at the Varrock Museum. Got us an extra about 75k herb lore experience. And we cleaned all our herbs and ended up with uh, a little bit north of 8 mil from herbs just from 0 to 1500 herbivore. Overall, pretty successful week. After this, we finally put the jar up in my house so we can see the Abyssal Sire. And we improved our pet habitat for one day when we get our first pet. <laughs>